Um, well, we feel very privileged here at the Countess of Chester Hospital um, to have been one of the hubs selected to give out the vaccination today and it was very exciting. It's going to be the largest scale vaccine programme this country has ever seen and it's a massive leap forward for us all, especially in having to reduce the restrictions that we all had to get used to in time. I'm really pleased to be able to tell you that this week GP practices across Cheshire will start to roll out the coronavirus vaccine within local communities. this morning uh, because I'm classed as one of the vulnerable staff members at Leighton Hospital. Um, I want to have the vaccine because I want to be able to provide care uh, for the patients within Leighton. Hey, I'm at Neston Medical Centre where we're starting our vaccination campaign. Uh, I'm the clinical director for Neston and Williston Primary Care Network. Uh, I'm just really delighted that we're going to start vaccinating today. It just feels like potentially the beginning of the end. It's been so lovely to see our patients. We couldn't do this without the volunteers. A big shout out to all our volunteers that have come forward. Um, I'm a volunteer. I just felt I had to do my bit to support them um, in getting everybody through this programme. Oh. as I expected, very well organised and I'm surprised at the number of helpers that have been available and how helpful they actually are. Fabulous, far far better than I expected and I'm very happy bunny all together as I was frightened to death. It's been brilliant. From the time I turned into the premises everybody speaks very well to you make you feel at home if that's the right word, put you at ease, that is great. Yeah. No problem at all. We found it absolutely amazing. Yeah, very well organised. And I recommend anybody thinking about it to go ahead and do it. It's absolutely easy. It, it just gives you peace of mind, you know, that's, that you, you know, at the moment you're frightened to go anywhere and you know, very reluctant to even to go out the house, you know, even though I don't hail for nothing. But, you know, you think you're going to bump into it one way or another. It's, you only look at the telly and there's one in 30 people now are catching it in different parts of the country. So it's really serious that you have the vaccine and, and get the peace of mind. Don't worry about it at all. Just go and get it. Make a lot of difference. I can, I can see me, all my family have not seen my grandchildren. My advice to you people out there is all of you, every single last one of you, Come and get your vaccines. It's worth it to save your lives and the lives of your friends and neighbours. What would you tell people about getting the vaccine? If it oh my God, I'd tell them to get one as soon as they was able to get one. Because I've just lost my son to the disease. He was hard working, he worked in care, and his funeral is tomorrow, and I wouldn't like anyone else to suffer like that.